Hold on, Cameron Grimes isn't waiting for the match to start. Grimes' opponent insulted him on social media. What do you expect? This is an overreaction to say the least. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 219 pounds, the superstar, Jack Rip the Savage. Some fans first heard of this competitor when he had a tryout match at a WWE Live event. He looked great that night, but he's taking things to a whole new level now. It's a feel-good story for him, and I respect that he paid his dues, but we'll see how he handles the pressure at this moment. There are no excuses. He knows it's time to go now. It's time to take this night to the moon. The wealthiest man in all of NXT. And his opponent from Burlington, North Carolina, weighing in at 220 pounds, Cameron Grimes. So you could say Cameron Grimes is similar to the million dollar man, Ted DiBiase, but even classier. Yeah! Cameron Grimes, a stock market savant, somehow made money buying coins for dogs. That's not exactly how that works, Saxon. I'll explain later, but Cameron Grimes about to make even more money tonight when he captures the winner's purse of this match. As the bell rings, this has already gone longer than their match last week that never actually got started after Cameron Grimes viciously attacked his opponent. His opponent who questioned whether Cameron Grimes was the greatest superstar to ever wear a hat. Can you blame Grimes for what he did? Uh, yeah, I can, and so did Grimes' mentor, Jeff Hardy. When the guy who trained you was calling you out, 
You clearly messed up. And look at this now. Yes, applying the submission hold. He's got it locked in. He may not have a choice. He may have to tap out. It is locked in. Uh, working on the Achilles, but not for long. Great counter. Uh-oh. Half and half suplex. Lights out. Double axe handle. Driving down with the axe handle. Elusiveness from Grimes. Back and forth from these competitors. Oh, God. That looked devastating. He steers clear of contact. And a reversal by Grimes. isn't being given any room to recover. Yeah, Grimes has... And here we go. Locked in. It's locked in. Into an armbar. Submission move locked in. The official asking him, is he going to tap? Is he going to tap out? He's trying to hold on, but for how long? And he releases the hold. I don't think he had it fully locked in. Oh, close line. Away. It's not embarrassing to tap out. He'll save your career. After all that punishment, he had no choice but to tap. An emphatic victory. As the bell rings, this has already gone longer than their match last week that never actually got started after Cameron Grimes viciously attacked his opponent. His opponent who questioned whether Cameron Grimes was the greatest superstar to ever wear a hat. Can you blame Grimes for what he did? Uh, yeah, I can, and so did Grimes' mentor, Jeff Hardy. When the guy who trained you was calling you out, you clearly messed up. Whatever. Grimes is gonna send his opponent to the moon again, and maybe this time you can go with him, Saxton. Ouch. Kick right to the back of the leg. Finds the advantage after a string of counters. Oh, on the apron, lifting it up into the ring. Bam, suplex. Rear chin lock, and now just rapid fire punches. Uh-oh, this is not going to look pretty. Submission being applied. Uh, this one's over. Tap out coming. Okay, he's it wasn't fancy, but they're free. Oh, look at that torch of their opponent. Uh oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, man. He's absorbed some damage already. He planned for this and could still rally. That gets reversed on Grimes. Double underhook applied. Butterfly suplex. Rear chin lock and now just rapid fire punches. Now oh, trampling the opposition. Knew what was coming there. Reversal after reversal. These two are ready for each other. Well, I think we're gonna... He's got the answer for that one. Grimes dodges that one. Oh, man. Oof, can't find it. Had that one scouted. Oh, that can rock you. He's returning fire. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. Uh-oh. Half and half suplex. Lights up. Ah, look at this. A systematic attack on that arm. Cameron Grimes with the cave in. Grimes hits the referee. That's on the referee. He needs to be more aware when Grimes is about to send his opponent to the moon.
Well, now it looks like Cameron Grimes is going to send his opponent a message with a baseball bat. It's Jeff Hardy. The charismatic enigma is here in NXT. But why? It appears he's trying to encourage his former student to take the high road here. What the heck? What was that all about? Now that's more like it. to the shocking actions from his so-called mentor, Jeff Hardy. Hey, you may not like how it went down, but at the end of the day, Jeff Hardy and Cameron Grimes are like family. And that means Hardy's gonna help Grimes get ahead in WWE, no matter what that entails. That's fine, but be upfront about it. Hardy was chastising Cameron Grimes on social media for using tactics like this, and then he turns around and does the same thing. Hopefully we'll get some kind of explanation from the charismatic Enigma before long.